Hi everyone, it's Exo Man, and I have a warning for you. Call it call it a PSA if you'd like. Uh, but first, take a look at this. This is a this is a hood over my window. It's just a, basically a plastic strip. I've had this car for uh, probably eight or ten years. This truck, and I've had these on. I think you can just buy. You could probably buy this from the dealer for any any model car or truck you have. But it's just a strip, like adhered to that to that window. You see how it's kind of glued on there, um, and that's the inside. You see how that vents my truck. I can vent the heat out of my truck. I leave these. I leave my windows cracked, <coughs> even if it's raining, <coughs> and that vents it nicely. So, what I want to talk about is something that my son warned me about a few years ago, and then a friend followed up with today, with in more detail. Um, and since my son warned me about it, I've been taking precaution, but it just occurred to me that not everybody knows and probably a lot of people don't know about this. And that is the danger of benzene. Benzene is a compound, a chemical compound found in, in the materials in your car. It's in the ductwork of your AC system, it's in your dashboard, it's in various parts of your car, and it is extremely toxic and dangerous. In, in you know, in, in, with prolonged exposure, um, this stuff can be can cause death. It can cause cancers, it, things like leukemia. It can cause miscarriages. It can cause poisoning of the bones with prolonged exposure. Um, and the problem is that your car emits this into the atmosphere inside. Okay, so when you have this closed up container, it's basically a gas chamber. Okay, and now let me say there's there's no conclu there's no conclusive study that links this to people's deaths per se, but benzene is studied and it is known to it is proven to be a deadly chemical, a very toxic chemical. So the problem is people are getting into these cars. It doesn't matter whether it's in the the heat of summer and your car is baking in the sun or it's in your garage. You're going to get uh, exposure to this benzene, let's call it a gas, when you get in this closed off chamber and turn on your AC, you're basically sucking in these fumes. However, it is a lot, a lot worse. You're going to get a lot higher levels of this into your lungs, into your body. It's going to spread throughout your body if your car is baking in the sun. That's a really, really dangerous scenario. So, again, no conclusive studies, but hey, who wants to breathe poison gas? It's a known carcinogen into their body. And it no doubt will be proven. It'll be studied and proven. I think this was, this, the more detailed information is coming from a neurologist out of Atlanta who, who's talked about this and written a paper on it. But I just, I wanted to share that with all of you. And I please, please share this video with your friends and loved ones. Get, let's get this information out there. Because, you know, it's, it's a small wonder with things like this, you know, we're all, getting, we're all being bombarded daily. It's a small wonder that so many people are, are, getting, are being stricken with cancer and, and, and killed by this terrible disease. Please share the information. Please observe some sort of protocol. A uh, good idea would be to get in your car, open your windows, drive your car and let it start venting before you turn your AC on. or get in your car, turn your AC on, open your doors or, and or windows, and let your car air itself out before you get in it and drive, okay? So thank you, uh, thank you to my son for, for sharing this with me and my family, and thank you to my friend uh, for sharing this on the internet, and um, let's stay safe. Thank you all, thank you very much for watching.